Yo, what's good, YouTube, man? It's Gabe with the Fan TV, man. Back at you another video. Like the content the video, go ahead and smash that like button. Like the content of this channel. Go over here and subscribe, man. Look. All right, man. The Raiders make their first change to the coaching staff. We knew changes would be coming. Uh, Todd Munkin said in his press conference that, um, you know, the, the coaching staff is sort of a work in progress. And these are one. Of, this is one of the moves that were made. The Ravens have decided to hire Willie Taggart to be the team's new running back coach. Now, a couple of thoughts about this before we get into who Willie Taggart is and things like that. Uh, this is a John Harbaugh hire, right? Um, doesn't really have any connection to Tom Muckin that I can see. Um, I've seen that. I put the tweet up on Tom Palacero that um, T Willie Tiger was the running backs coach for Jim Harbaugh at Stanford. So now he joins the, you know, his brother, John Harbaugh, in Baltimore. So family connection right there, Harbaugh connection right there. So it doesn't really seem to have too much to do with Tom Munkin, all right? That's the first thing. Uh, second thing, if we remember during the season when there was rumors of Greg Roman being fired, right? Uh, let go midseason, things like that. Willie Tackle was a name that was brought up that the Ravens might, a guy that the Ravens might bring in. And that kind of received a little bit of backlash because people didn't really like uh, Willie Tiger. So, you know, there was a concern that if he was brought in, we'd be kind of running the same similar kind of offense. But now he's not obviously not going to be the offensive coordinator. He's going to be the running backs coach. So I'm not really too much worried about his impact on the team um, overall as far as hurting the offense and things like that. Now, he is a position coach, so his job is still important. But, you know, it's it's a limited role compared to being an offensive coordinator, right? Um, now, so about Willie Tiger himself, where has he been? Uh, South Florida, Oregon, Florida State, Florida Atlantic. Uh, hasn't really worked out as far as him being a head coach, to be quite honest. Um, like I said, the last time he was a running backs coach was from 07 to 09 on Jim Harbaugh's staff at Stanford, okay? Uh, so the Ravens make another hire. Ravens make hire a guy that um, John Harbaugh knows well. Uh, he knows it from his brother's staff. I know a lot of Ravens fans feel about John Harbaugh hiring guys that he know. I get that. Um, I feel that same way a lot too, a lot of times, too. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll see what he can do, what he can bring to the Ravens uh, coaching staff, all right? Um, the Ravens' current running back coach, you know, is a guy named Craig Versteeg. Uh, he's been with the team since 2008, so since John Harbaugh was hired, he's been in the team. He's been with the team in a, a multitude of capacities. You know, he's been an offensive assistant, he's been a quarterback coach, senior offensive assistant, um, and he's been a running back coach since 2021. So um, I don't know if the Ravens will let, let him go, fire him. It seems like he could land in another role on the team, right? Because, um, like I said, he's been with Harbaugh since 08, so it seems like Harbaugh. Likes to keep this guy around, even if, even if it means moving uh, moving slots around on the coaching staff. So, like, he might be on the team still in some capacity. All right. Um, now, listen, this is interesting. Um, I was kind of hoping that the first uh, coaching staff change was something to do with Todd Munkin and somebody he's going to bring in for his staff that's going to know his system and things like that. But, um, like I said, this is a hardball move. So, I don't really think this affects the offense too much. What I'm looking out for is what's going to happen with uh, the QB coach, James Urban. I was looking on Twitter before, like maybe like last week, uh, Justin Rebeck was saying that um, maybe a guy like James Urban goes to Cleveland. Him and Kevin Stefanski apparently are close. Uh, Kevin Stefanski tried to hire him before, so that could be a position that opens up. We'll see what happens with that. Um, and we'll let, with the Ravens bringing a new offensive coordinator, um, you know, uh, Tom Munkin can want his guy there at the QB coach because I feel like a QB coach is kind of like a guy that's that's right there almost at that next tier next to the offensive coordinator a lot of the times. So, you know, we'll see what happens with that, right? Um, but as far as Willie Tiger, I know a lot of Ravens fans are going to be look at his record, his coaching record, and say this guy's not a good coach. And uh, I'm not going to disagree with you, but I, I personally really don't care. Um, he's a running backs coach. He'll he'll do his job fine. Uh, the running, Ravens running backs, to me, really haven't been an issue. Um, how many of us knew the name of Craig Versteeg before, you know, we just found out we got a new running back coach, right? I, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I did not know the running back's coach's name. You know what I mean? So um, that's one of the positions where the Ravens have done pretty well at. J.K., Gus, um, King and Drake, Justice Hill. I think they'll all still be fine, still be, you know, good running backs, you know, or whoever's back on the team, you know, uh, next season. So. Uh, for, as far as, you know, J.K. Dobbins, he's still going to be J.K. Dobbins. He's still going to be a good, fast, explosive player. Uh, the offensive of coordinator hire means more than him to me than I think the running back coach does. I think the running back coach will obviously work with him, get him as as right as he can. 
but uh, J.K. Dobbins is doing fine, so I don't really have any too too much concerns about um, Willie Taggart in that role. I, I really don't. Okay, uh, but he was like I said, he was a Stanford um, running backs coach, and I believe um, he was a running back coach for Toby Gerhardt when Toby Gerhardt had that great season at Stanford. So um, you know he had some experience turning a guy who wasn't you know the 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 biggest talent. It's a guy who was like a Heisman Trophy candidate. You know, that's what Toby Gerhardt turned into. So it's an interesting hire for the Ravens. I'm not going to say it holds um, too much value. I'm not going to uh, say that it's anything that's like Ravens fans should be um, overly concerned about or something that's like they got to uh, put at the top of their list. You know, it is what it is. It's, it's, it's an interesting hire. We'll see how much he does. Uh, but knowing the fact that they were talking to him um, in the middle of season, last, like in the middle of this past season, because there were reports about that, it really shouldn't be too surprising the fact that he's hired now. You know what I mean? Listen, John Harbaugh is going to do what he wants with his staff. You know what I mean? Uh, it is what it is on that front. Um, as long as it doesn't get in the way of the offensive coordinator, the offensive goal, the offensive mission, whatever. I, you know, to me, I made a video with when I first made the video about Todd Munkin changed the offensive staff. The one, there were two guys I really want them to keep is T. Martin and uh, Keith Williams. If they keep those two guys. I'm really fine with what they do with the rest of the staff, in my opinion. You know, if they can keep those two guys, I'm I'm good with it. Uh, so the Ravens hire Willie Tiger. Um, comment down below your thoughts on the hire. Do you care? Do you not care? I don't think it's that big of a deal. I don't think it's something the Ravens fans should be up in arms about. I'm also not something that it should be super exciting. I think it's kind of just a, is what it is kind of deal. So, uh, but anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments, and we'll talk about it below. Uh, it's your boy Gabriel, just another fan TV. I'm out.